Hi everyone, Video James here. Um, I'm gonna show you a pickup video of uh, some stuff I got for my birthday trip down to Cleburne and Burleson, Texas. Um, and Arlington, Texas, where we'll start with, uh, got Metal Gear Solid 3 Subsistence. Uh, already had it, but uh, in the collection, but it doesn't come with this second disc, which I really wanted to play because uh, I really wanted to play the originals for the MSX, and I don't own a Japanese computer from the 80s, so here you go. up I uh, it's hooked up right now my wife's playing it got a Sega Genesis uh, I used to have one as a kid really glad to have one now uh, it's a square one uh, one of the rectangle one but you take what you can get sometimes got a really good deal on some boxed Sega games at a uh, game exchange in Cleburne Eternal Champions great fighting game used to rent this all the time I didn't really own a whole lot of Sega games back in the day I actually had um, rented most of them so this fun rental of course this came with my Sega so when I saw it in the box and the not for resale box I'm like that, that who knows it could be mine could be mine and then uh, Street Fighter special championship edition another great game great rental um, the, I think the Genesis pad is the best for fighting games next to a joystick um, at the Cleburne Game Exchange, as I was buying stuff, uh, they were like, "If you buy, if you grab one more game for six ninety-five, it'll be free," which is a great hookup. So I went with X-Men: Mutant Apocalypse, mainly because it's a really good game, and I have played it before um, at a friend's house when I was growing up. But uh, what really makes this good is I have very few Super Nintendo games because they're a little pricey. Um, gonna have to find a better place to get some of those. My wife picked up Pikmin 2, one of her favorite games. Don't know why we sold it. If it was hers, that she usually hangs on to her stuff. I, I usually am the one who takes the hit and has to sell all my stuff to uh, pay the bills or feed the kids. Um, this one, just a great game. She already got a really good deal on the first one. Thought that was a good deal with the artwork, and we kept finding it without it. I said with mustard. Make it two. Mustard. Control is good. You can see how good is two commanders lead to planetary treasure hunting Pikmin 2. With two player mode, may the best scavenger win. Only for Nintendo GameCube. Great for everyone. Real quick, she has uh, Echo the Dolphin. I personally do not like this game. Uh, she's glaring at me right now over while she's playing my Sega. Um, she's gonna play it later, and without the internet, she would get, never get off the first level, just saying. Maybe we'll do a, um, can, can she play it, Echo the Dolphin. Yeah, her and Google are gonna play it. I got Shadow Dancer. They didn't have Shinobi 3, so I got Shadow Dancer, The Secret of Shinobi. Fine, great game. Uh, X-Men 2. Uh, apparently other James wanted this uh, I didn't know wasn't aware so I kind of sniped it from out from under him but here's the story my wife calls me while we're at retro madness in Hearst Texas and tell and is talking to me as I walk away from looking at Nintendo games turn around get off the phone other James says hey look I found Ninja Turtles 2 the arcade game is just looking at it. But, you know, that's how it goes. Alright, what, what do you think about me getting X-Men 2 when you had been looking for it? Yeah, I think I got shafted. I uh, got Mega Bomber Man. My wife says you can't find it for too many places cheap. So we did pick it up cheap, which makes me happy. I just love these look of these old cartridges. They're so tiny, but you know, the Nintendo we were, you know, two of them was the size of a Nintendo cartridge. So I remember when I got this as a kid, I was like, well, the cartridge has shrunk, but the controller got bigger and more buttons. Um, boy, I'm glad I only paid $2 for this, but it's Mortal Kombat 2. Not that it's a bad game, but uh, it it's, it's falling apart here. 
Um, if anyone thinks I should repair it or uh, order a new sticker, let's you know. Let me know in the comments. Okay, getting to the big ones. Uh, stuff I said earlier with uh, with uh, Ashley with the uh, Materia girl. Um, we're looking for Lunar, as you can see already. Got it. Walked in, turned to my left at Game Exchange in Burleson. It was there for the cheapest price I've ever seen it. Complete. I was about to buy it online for $10 more than I paid for it. Um, but it didn't have the music CD. Now that I'm gonna drive around listening to the music CD, I'll just play it when I wanna bug my wife. But just great. <laughs> Unfortunately, it's like the third time in my life I've bought it and so I'm restricted from selling it ever. today to find just sitting on a shelf in the Burleson Game Exchange. Legend of Legaia. I screwed up once upon a time and thought I was ordering this off eBay for a ridiculous price. Um, it was the demo. Uh, other James and my wife really laughed hard at that when I got that in the mail. They, they love to laugh at my despair. Um, but I am pretty boneheaded one t sometimes. Um, best price I've found it for, honestly. I mean, I go to a lot of places and, and everything, but um, I mean, I, I bought this game. I remember I had stayed up with my friend and we had stayed up all night. And then we forgot after staying up all night that our other friend's mom was gonna come and get us and take us to Tulsa. This is when I lived in Fort Gibson, Oklahoma. Go Tigers. But uh, took us to, they took us to Tulsa where they had a game exchange. It's gone now. It's a great game exchange, friendly people. And they just got this out. And incidentally, I think I paid the same new for this that day as I did used for it today. Who's counting? But um, man, uh, I really like this game. I don't know why. The storyline, I really like that the battles kind of keep you more interested than most RPGs. And I'm a nut for RPGs. I'm going to try the sequel someday on the PS2. Well, guys, that uh, concludes my birthday game finds. I'm going to... Uh, this is September, when my birthday is, and uh, it'll probably come up later after we do our first show, but I just wanted to, you know, make sure to capture it on film and show you guys some of the things that I like and that I'm interested in uh, and would love for you to share what you're interested in and what you have. I mean, you don't need much to share. $6 lapel mic, you know, decent Sony digital camera. Um, my tripod is a couple, a, 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 it's Tetris for the Game Boy. It's a PSP case and it's on top of a Coke box. So you don't need much to share guys. Get out there and share. I'd love to see your videos and uh, see you later.